This video is just a short extract from the entire course. If you wish to see all of the videos from this series at higher quality and in far larger screen size, head over to ifskills.com. Having the ability to add extra sections by splitting existing sections is all very well, but you're also going to need the ability to either remove some of the sections or merge them with existing sections. Perhaps the need for the split is no longer there, or we're further down the line and you decide to do things a different way. Or you might just have asked for too many sections in the first place. So if we take our AdventureWorks grouped by territory underscore multiple sections, this already has multiple sections within it. And in fact, the page header has some content in its second and third section, so page header B and page header C. It's merely a label, but in preview, that label appears at the top of every page because we've not controlled how these page headers are going to work, they will just display all the time. So if we want to delete an existing section, we could do that in a couple of ways. We can go across to the left hand side here. Let's say for example, report header C, right click and delete section. And that will remove report header C. Now if there were any contents within there, they would also go. So if we were to take page header C, right click, delete, it's gone, but so is its contents. And notice there was no, are you sure you want to remove the contents? So you have to be very careful about which sections you are deleting. Obviously there's an undo if you make a mistake, but you can only undo something you've just done, not six months down the line. We can delete sections by using the section expert. Pick on a section you'd like to lose. So report header B and delete at the top. That's gone, and now you'll notice report header is just one section, so it removes the A as well. There's no requirement for it. Okay, and our report goes back to just having a report header. So that's deleting sections, removing them when they're no longer required. The other option is to merge them together. So it may be that I'd like to retain the contents of page header B and C, but I don't need it to be split anymore. I can put them all into one header. I could merge these three together. So in the section expert, if I want to merge some sections together, I simply select the section that I would like to merge with the next one. So selecting page header A and coming up to the merge icon here will actually merge it with page header B. So if I go click merge, A and B become one and C gets effectively upgraded to B. So we say OK. You can see that the text that was in page header B has now been moved into page header A. The text that was in page header C has now effectively been promoted into page header B. So we can do that again in the section expert, select page header A and click merge again. That reverts me back to one page header, but the contents that were in that B will have been moved up into the page header. So that's okay. So both of these labels are now in the page header. So that's merging sections. You do it with the page footer, right click, section expert, choose the one above the one you want to merge with, and then merge. Now it can be done from the right click over here as well. So we could right click, merge section below, and that will revert my page footer back to being a single section because the A and the B have been merged together. So we can delete sections if they're no longer required, or we can merge them within existing sections.